Well, we thought uh, about uh, creating a course for BI professional who makes uh, BI projects for living. And uh, uh, these people probably already use analysis services or they may have already used other tools uh, of other vendors uh, and uh, already know about uh, Data Warehouse, about uh, Star Schema, about um, maybe OLAP and so on any BI professional is interested in uh, this course. Either you already use multidimensional or you never use multidimensional, but you just are interested in uh, uh, the Microsoft BI stack. Now, Tabular is a new technology, is a new engine and uh, has a new language, which is DAX. And so this course is uh, to introduce this technology to these people uh, that we expect to have already a very good knowledge about SQL, about uh, data modeling uh, for analysis and so on. You need to understand that Tabular is a totally new environment. It's a new engine, it's uh, a new language, a new way of creating solutions. <music> You need to be a BI professional. You need to know what a dimensional modeling is. You need to know what a data warehouse is. You need to understand a bit of SQL. You need to understand how to shape some data. And you need to have a knowledge of uh, the kind of queries and the kind of reports you want to build out of uh, a data warehouse. We have a few uh, prerequisites for the course, which are, like you said, uh, SQL, the SQL language, uh, the data modeling, uh, we will not spend say, we will not spend time saying what is a star schema. So if you don't know what is a star schema, you will be you will find this course very hard to follow. Whenever I have a classroom uh, where most of the people know multidimensional, I spend some time doing a parallel between what you did before and what you will do in the future with Pabular. And moreover, I spend time highlighting the differences between the two engines because many people come from a knowledge of multidimensional and they try to do data warehouses and data models in the same way. Unfortunately, this is wrong because uh, Tabular is so different from multidimensional that you need to use a different approach to the data modeling in order to get good results with Tabular. If you have uh, an experience about multidimensional, Attending the course, we will, you will see the comparison between, between these two um, different way of modeling data and these two different engines. But at the same time, if you don't have a previous experience about uh, multidimensional, there is nothing that uh, you will not understand during the course because uh, any knowledge about multidimensional is not really useful in tabular. We start from scratch and we go to a very deep level of understanding of the tabular model, just speaking about tabular. After three days, uh, we've spent time teaching many, many concepts and you will make practice through exercises, which are not just uh, learning the user interface of Visual Studio, but are more uh, exercises about uh, the right way of creating a data model for Tabular and the right way to create uh, expressions in DAX. We spend time on two different uh, topics, uh, which are how to build a data model and how to program it with the DAX language. At the end of the course, you will have a knowledge about uh, how to create a data model, how to, how to correctly use DAX for calculated columns, for measures, which are the type of calculations that you can implement in the data model. And we will also know about uh, how to deploy a project, uh, how to handle the security, for example. So all the technical details that are required in order to make uh, a, sol a solution in production. You need to understand how the VertiPack engine works, how the DAX queries are resolved, and how DAX works. Once you have this solid foundation, on this you can start building data models and then create DAX formulas that work very fast. If you don't know the internals, then you will not be able to get the best out of Tabular. If 
if your experience is just uh, learning the user interface in Visual Studio, how to import tables and how to deploy a simple project and how to navigate into by using a pivot table in Excel, okay, that's not enough. This is just uh, maybe the first uh, 10 minutes of the workshop. We spend time speaking about details uh, and teaching what uh, it's really hard to understand uh, without a lot of experience. So if you started using Tabular but you are not very confident with it, uh, then attending the course is good. I already teached many, many editions of the Tabular workshop and I found that also people who were using uh, Tabular since uh, three, six months uh, uh, after three days said, oh, Marco, we learned a lot of things. If only we, uh, we knew this, uh, these uh, concepts before starting our project, we would have saved a lot of time and we would have improved the performance a lot in our real project. I cannot say that after one course of three days, uh, you become a master of DAX uh, and a seasoned BI professional. That is, that is clearly not true. In three days, we are able to transfer knowledge to let you avoid all the mistakes that you can do without a good uh, uh, theoretical foundation. Thank you and see you at the next workshop. <laughs>